going to use the tree diagram when we're going to consider this problem again with this five days. Now this first trial now is that we randomly pick one. Alright, we pick one this. And then for example like this, and we go, oh red, and then we put it aside. So the second trial, we're only going to have four this left. So this is the case of without replacement. How would this going to be different? Well, before green, two fifth, we know that. Not green, three out of five. If one green has been picked, next time there's going to be one green left. So now we only have one out of four for green. Not green, three out of four. Agree? Now, if a not green is picked in the first time, then in the second time, we're going to have two greens left. So two out of four. But the, the non green is also two out of four. And you can see that this add up to one. That also add up to one. Now, we can now then calculate this probability of first green and the second green. So two fifth times one fourth. So the answer to this is uh, 2 over 20 or 1 over 10. Next, uh, 2 fifth times 3 quarter. So the answer is 6 out of 20 or 3 out of 10. Of this problem, so one green. Well, one green here means uh, this is not okay. So here is okay. So one green and not green, not green and green. So there are two possibilities here. So probability of one green in this case is just going to be three ten plus three ten. So it's six ten or two fifth. Right. Next probability at least one green. So this is okay. This is okay and that's okay. So probability of at least one green. Then in this case will be one ten plus three ten plus three ten or seven over ten. And the last question is first green and second not green. Well, first green and second not green is just this. So, for the C, the answer is just 3 out of 10. And you can see that when we without replacement, you just have to change that the, the bottom part that the denominator is changed. And you have to be careful that 5 and that you don't repeat 5 here. And it's 4 now. Okay? 1 over 4.